right, my name's Xavier Grice. I'm 45 years old. I'm a correction officer. Been doing that for 20 years. I have three teenagers, 19, 17, and 13. Well, actually 14. And the reason I wrote this book is for my teenagers. I wrote this for they have something to look back on about their father after he's gone. Hopefully it inspire them. Hopefully it inspire other people. I have some just some general observations from the average man's uh, perspective and I have some quotes in there stuff that I made up that hopefully if you don't like anything else out the book you might find one or two quotes that you can use on a daily basis where you might just get up and something might be going wrong in your day and you might read this quote out this book and it might change your perspective for that day where you can go on and have a positive day. My three children inspired me to write the book, Simple Thoughts. Uh, I wanted to have something for them to look back on as a positive thing in their life and let, they, let them know that their father was here and he'd done something positive and something that they could hold on to. And if they get down, uh, sad about something, they could pick up the book and feel my presence as they turn the pages of this book and hopefully let them uh, progress in their day and move forward and have a positive life and share some of what I wrote in this book with their kids and other family members and other people that they come in contact with. First of all, I've already had this book published through iUniverse and I've already gone through all the legal stuff to have it copyrighted. But what I'm trying to do is get volume two published and I'm trying to get the book promoted and get the book out there where more people will be able to pick the book up. No, more people will know if that the book is out there because like you said, I got the book out there online for Amazon, Barnes and Nobles, eBay, and different book sites, but nobody knows it's there. So basically what I'm trying to do is get it out there in the general public where everybody knows it's there, people are talking about it, trying to get a buzz around it, but people are, will go pick the book up. be to be able to do this full time and to retire from the Department of Corrections. I've been doing that for 20 years and with this book hopefully I could make enough where I could retire to influence some young men because I've seen what having a lack of positive images and influence due to them from 12 to 13 and they end up in the prison system and I just want to let them know that prison is not a rite of passage to becoming a man. That if you can catch them at a younger age and help them, you know, inspire them, put them in sports, you know, maybe some of them are expiring writers, artists, and they just don't have the right people behind them to push them. That's what I would like to do full time. So with this book, I would like to be able to make enough where I can expire, inspire, and catch some of these younger guys before they take that wrong turn and end up in prison. Like I said, I've been there for 20 years and I've seen kids 16 years old in a maximum security prison. He's supposed to be in high school, enjoying his life, and he's in prison, you know, and I'm handcuffing him, taking him to a shower, and then taking him back to his room. Now, that's not what you're supposed to be doing at 16. And I would like to catch some of these young guys at a younger age and try to prevent you know, further generation from thinking that that's what you have to do to become a man is come to prison. That is not a choice that you really want to make, so I'm trying to catch them at a younger age. That's what I would like to do with this book. My name is Xavier Grice, and thanks for taking the time out to watch the introduction to the book Simple Thoughts.